Hey guys, so today we're going to be going a little bit more in depth on dwarf pufferfish, BB pufferfish, pea puffers, and what you feed them. So, a lot of people don't know this when they get them, but these guys are actually carnivores, meaning they won't just eat your standard tropical flake food. They don't eat flake food, they won't even eat pellet food. They only will go for live foods or frozen foods. So, I'm going to talk about their main diet, and their main diet consists of live aquarium snails, bloodworms, brine shrimp, anything of that matter, these guys will eat. But I personally prefer the easiest method, and that is just live snails. You have a one gallon tank or anything really. You just get some of these snails from any pet store for free. They're pet snails, so they'll just give them away. They look like this right here. I believe these guys are just ram's horn snails. Very hard to see on camera right now, but there they are. And then you basically will just plop these guys in the tank, and the puffer fish will actually suck the snail part out of the shell. So I'll go ahead and put those in right now. And you can see them immediately go after them. And as you can see, they basically just go in there and suck the snail part right out of the shell. Like so. So they'll basically just continue to do this to one snail until there's nothing left and it's just an empty shell. So dwarf puffers are not like other puffers that need to eat the entire snail shell to basically file down their teeth. Dwarf puffers don't have this problem, so they only need the meat out of the snail, and that's the only part they eat. As you can see, he's still just going at this snail. And if you don't want to deal with live snails or anything of that matter, you can always feed them frozen brine shrimp or frozen bloodworms. I find they like frozen bloodworms a lot more. And then as a guide to feed them, I feed them two to three small snails, and them, I only have one. I feed my little guy two to three small snails, which are basically like half of his size a day usually in the mornings I just throw them in and he can go ahead and hunt them throughout the day so that is just my quick little video on how to feed these guys just remember they won't eat your flake food if you're just trying to feed them flake food they will starve and they will die you're gonna need that live food like the snails or the frozen bloodworms if they won't eat frozen bloodworms at first you're mainly just gonna have to try live snails to get them accustomed to the food then you can go ahead and lean them on to frozen food if you still don't like doing the live snails. I will say it does kind of get annoying getting all the uh, dead snail shells out of the tank, but it's really not that big of a deal. But if you thought it was really an issue, you could just always just feed the frozen food daily. But that is pretty much it for this video. Just as a reminder, we're trying to get to a thousand subscribers by February 20th, so if you could drop a sub down below, that would be awesome. If you enjoyed this video or if you even found this helpful and if you like the content I'm producing, Thank you guys so much. Goodbye.